Hey guys, I got a set of four hubcaps, the dog dish hubcaps, for a 61, 62 Bel Air or Biscayne. They are not perfect and they have not been cleaned. I've had this, I've had this stuff for years. As I, as I said, I'm a hoarder, I'm a pack rat. I don't know where I got them. I don't know how I come to get them, but I've got them. And if you're, if you've got one 61 or 62, uh, Bel Air or Biscayne this, these are cor the correct hubcaps 14 inch for 14 inch wheel so uh, I'm going to try to okay this I'm going to call this one number one looks like it's got a little dent other than that just needs a real good cleaning number two has a really really small dent one right there and it's kind of humped up right here it's got some dent They've all got a couple of dents in them. Um, this, yeah, they've all got a little dent or two in them. This is kind of caved in. That should be pretty easy to push out. But I don't have a Bel Air anymore, so I was saving these hubcaps for them, for, for my Bel Air, uh, 62 Bel Air, but I no longer have it, so I don't need these hubcaps. I don't know. If you know somebody that's looking for a set of hubcaps like this, I'll let them go relatively cheap. Uh, I, I'm, I'll take a hundred dollars or best offer. They, they need cleaned up. I think if you took them and cleaned them up real good, they'd have a real good shine. But I haven't touched them. I, I forgot I even had them. So that's that's just how I am. But they've got dents in them. Most of them, I think, you can get out with just a little patience and uh, you know get away from your kids or wife or husband or something for a few minutes you could probably get all these cleaned up pretty nicely but i'll take a hundred dollars or best offer you pay shipping and uh i've kind of looked around uh on ebay and stuff and that's cheaper than anything that's on ebay but anyway as i said these need a little work if you're like me and you're on a budget you're looking for a set of these here they are all four Hundred dollars or best offer. You pay shipping. Uh, if you're interested, subscribe. Leave me a comment and let me know how I can get in touch with you, and we'll kind of go from there. Let's see. Uh, what else do I have that I'm going to get rid of uh, that I don't need? Uh, let's see. Got this stuff. Oh, there's an old link and a horn button. Uh, looks like a Toyota Corolla emblem or something. I'm not sure. As you see, I'm a pack rat. Okay, somebody might be interested in these. I'm not for sure. But these are Ford Eddie Bauer uh, emblems. Back in the day, I had a 86 Ford uh, Bronco. That was Eddie Bauer edition. I think this goes on the dash this one these two go on the front fenders so if you're interested in them holler at me I don't never see these anymore so I was tickled to get them because I had one that came off and man I did not realize how hard they was to find so if you're interested in them let me know uh, I'm assuming that's for a Ford but I could be wrong these if I'm not mistaken uh, maybe like for a 52, 3, or 4 Ford car. If I'm not mistaken. And uh, if, you need, if you need those, let me know. Uh, let's see. Hey, this one right here, this little tab is broke. I didn't know that. I'm trying to be as honest as I can. These right here just kind of stick on, as you can see, on the fenders. That's why I lost mine. And I uh, see. I don't need this stuff either. I, I'm a hoarder. I, do, I like emblems. I love steering wheels. I love horn buttons. Just let me know if you're interested in any of this stuff. And we can kind of go from there. But the Lincoln horn button... I'll take a hundred for it. I'm sure that's from the 40s. Maybe 30s. I forgot I had that. Anyway. 
I'm going to put all this stuff back in this little box. And if you're interested in it, as I said, subscribe, leave me a comment and a way to get a hold of you. And with all this stuff I've got, please mention what you're interested in too. I appreciate it. And, uh, okay. Hey, y'all have a good day. Hopefully somebody will contact me and need something. Okay, appreciate it. Y'all uh, make me a reasonable offer on this stuff. Thanks, appreciate it. I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.